Hello, welcome to the channel. I'm Sean. I'm Chris. And today we are brought here to check out Real Boy. Do I look like a real boy, Papa? Yeah, I'm excited to check it out. The White Midnight song. I've been jamming that out since <laughs> we've heard it. I like... I think I go through like real phases. Because like even her last album, I sit there and it's like for like a whole month, it's like, yeah, this is what I'm listening to. This whole <laughs> album. Um, but yeah, I really like the White Midnight. It was different than her previous shit so i'm excited to see where this goes yeah yeah I, i'm interested to see where it's at now it's funny how just because of recent shit that we've listened to that because like the feels by twice that song <laughs> so now she's like boy yeah boy yeah boy you know like not even close to relevant <laughs> to this but i read that and that's what popped into my head stop it get some help i'm sure no in her style that it's going to be good. Yeah. And completely different than The Feels by Twice. <laughs> oh, yeah. Pretty sure. But I'm excited to hop in and see what we got going on. So can you think of anything before we get going? <sighs> Ready to check it out? Okay. Yeah. Well, if you are new here, hit subscribe. We notice and appreciate it. Think you're pretty cool if you do. And leave a comment. We'd like to read them and reply. Boy, yeah, boy, yeah. Oh, we get the more like rap focus yeah. feel this time. I I like it because her voice is very unique. But then the da 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 da, it's like okay, like you don't really expect that that yeah. style from her. You know what I mean? That's catchy as fuck, man. Right. We get some little high pitch in there from her. <laughs> voice is already high, but it's like such a driving force. But she's going so fast, but it doesn't lose like the feel of it. Yeah, the you know cadence I mean? in it. Like, like it, yeah. it's like a, it's still a driving force, but it's like groovy, even though she's going like double time over the top of it. It's a cool style. <laughs> Imagine going to her concert and like a bunch of Molly, you know? <laughs> right. The 
Yeah, that was pretty badass. Yeah, I was down. She was low key going like hard as fuck throughout yeah. the entire time. So, and still made it catchy. Like, right. It, it still, like you said, kept you on beat, kept that driving right. force in it. And then even the chorus part was super catchy. Like, yeah. You can just go right along with it. Like, yeah. It's a weird that. style because she's also like, it has like this club beat in the background, but it doesn't feel like you're at a rave or anything, yeah. you know? Um, it's not overbearing. You know? Right. Everything is. Everything with her is like ex- on the extreme ends, but when you put it all together, it's like, oh, that's a, a nice, like, groovy song. It's like, how do you get like <laughs> rave beats, fucking spitting some bars, some high pitch falsetto, and end up a groovy? Like, yeah. Yeah. Props, I guess. But yeah, that was a lot of fun. So far, that's my, probably my favorite song of the day. Like, I would I'll definitely add that to the playlist and jam it out again. Yeah, so, for sure. Need to look up and see if this is all off an upcoming album or if the album's just a already out. Or, yeah. yeah. I mean, because the White Midnight song, I assume, would be on the same thing that this would be on. They're only a couple months apart. Yeah. We'll figure all that shit out. But yeah, a lot of fun. I really like the song. Can you think of anything else before we get out of here? No. Glad we checked it out. Yeah, yeah that was cool. Well, thanks for watching with us. See you next time.